<laughs> welcome back or welcome to my channel so today we're gonna be reviewing this 34 inch wig from Asteria hair <laughs> Look at her, look at her. So before we get into the review portion of the video, you're gonna see the install. I filmed the install already. Um, I filmed the install on Sunday, and so I've had this wig on for four days now, four or five days. So yeah, I'm filming the review portion today, but after this clip, y'all will see the install portion of the video. So after that, we'll get into the review, so stay tuned till the end because I will be giving my thoughts on this wig and giving you all the details so y'all can go purchase it because you want it. By the way, this video is not sponsored. None of my past wig videos, none of the videos I've ever done have been sponsored. I purchased all these items, all the wigs I've ever had with my own money. So as always, if you want to see how I achieve this look, then keep on watching. So this is what I do to style the hair or really define the curls and then I just let it dry. 
So I'm gonna let this dry and then I'll come back, fluff it out a little bit and we'll get into this review. Okay. If you wanna see a more detailed video of how I install my wigs, I already have a video on that. So I'll link it below, which is why I sped up the install because there's no need for me to go through that as I said in the last video. And I probably will continue to say as long as my install routine is the same, then I will refer y'all to that video. So let's get into this wig. Again, I purchased this wig from Asteria Hair. So I filmed the unboxing already. So I'm gonna insert that clip over this. This is what the box looks like that it came in. It's just like a white and greenish mint green color. It says Asteria Hair on it. We open the box and the first thing you have is your wig in a plastic bag and a hairnet. Comes with two wig caps, an elastic band, and this is the best part. I've never seen a company do anything like this. Well, I've never purchased from a company that has included this in their packaging. And this is so bomb. Like, I need both of these items. It came with a edge scarf that says Asteria Hair in this really pretty, like, emerald green color. And it says Asteria Hair in gold, glittery writing. Like, how cute is that? How cute is that? And I've already been using it. I, like, I had a wig installed before I installed this wig. And I had got this in the mail. And I opened it when I did the unboxing. And I was like, I'm gonna use this tonight to tie my lace down, tie my edges down. So I've already been using that, so love that. And it comes with a little satin little bag to put your wig in after you take it out the box. Like, I've never seen any other company do that. Not that I've purchased from. I'm sure there are maybe other companies out there that do that, but I've never purchased from anybody that has done that. Yeah, it comes with a little bag to put your wig in. It says to steer your hair just for your beauty on the bag like how cute that was very nice of them to include that very handy i'll put the direct link to this wig in the description box so you can go purchase it this is their water wave lace front wig 180 percent density the color is natural black and i got it in 34 inches it's swiss lace the lace color is medium brown and i got a large cap size now i pretty much love everything about this wig like the hair the pattern is i like the um the loose curl patterns because they're much easier to manage like they don't tangle up as bad you know but the cap size i got a large like i struggled to get this on like i was tugging on it to get it on so i'm not i can't really say that it's big head friendly because i had a hard time getting it on but i mean i got it on eventually but i had a hard time getting it on plus i have thick hair I have a lot of hair but usually if i order a large cap size my head is already big plus i have a lot of hair um usually if i order a large from a lot of places it's big enough to fit my head and my hair but this i had a hard time getting it on and like i was getting really frustrated about that the lace melted really well like it looked really good the lace looked super good when i installed it like it melted really well into my skin i was having trouble like when i would pull the lace forward and into the glue. I think it was cause the wig was too small, but like I could pull one side, like I would do the middle first and then I would do the sides. I could pull one side and the other side would be like back here, like way back here. And I was like snatching it to get it to be where the other side was. So like it wouldn't stay. So I'm pretty sure that has to do with it not fitting my head, not being my size. When I order large, I usually order large anyway, but it just wasn't, it just wasn't fitting. Like, I had to fight with it for a little bit and I finally got it on, so. Yeah, other than that, I had no problems with this wig. Um, it does shed when I comb it. Every time I comb it, it sheds. Um, it doesn't shed really when I'm just walking around or like just sitting here. It doesn't shed, but um, combing it, I usually get a little bit of shedding, a good little bit, not like a whole lot, but I get some shedding when I comb it and detangle it every day. All I do as far as defining the pattern, defining the curl, I do the same thing every morning. I just wet it, comb it, and then put some foam wrap on it and this is what it gives me and then you can style it how you want once you've done that and let it dry i usually wear it like this in its natural state and let it dry i want it a really long wig um, the density is pretty good on it like i don't have any problems like bending over and my hair busts down the middle you can see my tracks i don't have no problems with that i can't stand when company do that like how can you have a wig so thin that it's busting down the middle and you can see your tracks? Like, that's not cute. Like, why would you Why would you do that? Didn't have that problem with this wig. The frontal part of this wig is 20 inches. I think that's what they said. Yeah, the frontal part of the wig is 20 inches and then obviously the rest is 34. I guess 20 inches is the longest that it comes for um, the frontal part of it. I haven't had any problems with this wig besides it not fitting my head even though I got a large. So I don't know what's going on there, but um, it's not heavy at all. Um, I'm sure most people would expect it to be heavy because it's so long, but um, it's not heavy at all, like it's real light, so 
yeah i really like this hair um i wore it to new york which y'all see in the new york vlog which is why i installed it sunday because i left on monday morning and i've had it on since then and haven't had any trouble with the lace lifting or anything like that so everything was really good i'm gonna say this one more time this is from Asteria Hair. It's the 34 inch water wave lace front wig on their website. Other than the size of the wig, I'm obsessed with this. I'm super obsessed with this hair. Like, and it's so me, like I'm super like, I wouldn't say dramatic, but kind of dramatic. I'll wear like the average length hair, but I love like long hair. Like I just love long hair. I also plucked this wig and bleached the knots on it. I plucked a lot, like a lot of hair out of this wig. It was a huge ball of hair like when I was done plucking it so I plucked a lot. Parting space is good like I didn't have to pluck my part or anything like that. Um, parting space is really nice. I love this hair like I love this. I feel like a doll like wearing this hair like I feel like bougie. I'll insert some clips of me how long the wig is like where it stops at on me that I took when I was in New York just videos of myself I took in my hotel room. So this is where it stops at on me this is the length of it and then just a couple pictures I took in the wig so y'all can kind of get an idea of how it looks when it's like fully dry and I like fluff it out. But I'm actually about to go take some pictures in this top now. I got this top from Fashion Nova. This was in my $500 on Fashion Nova haul. If you haven't seen that video, this was included in that haul. But I'm actually about to go take some pictures in this. It's actually really warm outside today. I thought it was a good time to wear this top and I've been wanting to wear it because it's so cute. This is so pretty. Like look at the pattern. Like it's still a little bit wet in some areas, but um I love it other than the issue I was having getting it on. It was just a little bit too small for my head and my to fit all my hair up under here. I wasn't gonna let that stop me because I really wanted to wear this wig. Like, I was super excited about it and it's just so pretty. Like, I wasn't gonna let it not fitting stop me from wearing it. Like, I was gonna get it on there. It was going on my head regardless. That's all I have to say about this wig. If you wanna purchase it again, it'll be linked below. All the details on it will be in the description. Um, don't forget to follow me on my social medias. I've Posted pictures in this hair already. I'm about to go take some pictures now. I'll post those if you want to see those. You know, follow me on my Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, whatever. All that is in the description below. And yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, please. And thank you. And make sure you have your post notifications turned on so you don't ever miss when I post because you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. So make sure your post notifications are on and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.